So I recently did a review of this little pulse arc hobby welder and a few people in the comment section said that it was too weak and useless for anything larger than tiny jump rings. I disagree. I personally use it for larger projects than that, although I do admit that it has its limits. Then I saw a comment where someone suggested that I replace the ground wire with a thicker one. I didn't have a thicker copper wire, so I just doubled up two of the same. Having this welder makes stuff like this really easy, since it eliminates most soldering jobs too. I figured using two wires would be enough to determine if a single thicker wire would lower the resistance enough to give the welder a little more power. For the test, I'm going to use this piece of scrap steel pipe. Prior to this mod, I don't think the welder could handle something this big, so this is going to be perfect for a test. I'm going to weld it to this piece of stainless steel. That seems like it worked really well. Let me put it in the vise and see if I could break it loose. As you can see, it's really on there. I'm going to call this mod confirmed. I mean, the weld's probably not as strong as a TIG, but if you're looking for a small hobby welder that doesn't require any shielding gas, I did a full review on my YouTube channel.